Now we're back to the wild card gun. My grandfather's sporterized K98 with a Williams receiver sight. Uh, I got some old 8mm ammo a guy gave me. I fired the 308 stuff. This is the only commercial stuff I have. And I'm going to try to see how it mates up. All I got is a ton of surplus ammo. Uh, but I will get, as we fool with this further, I will buy some soft point ammo and uh, factory ammo and see how the rifle does. Now I got to see if I can remember the sight picture and get in there. Okay, the gun is still shooting high and to the right. So, uh, I didn't bring a screwdriver either. Probably needs a sight adjustment. And again, you know, when a different person like my grandfather sighted this gun and it shoots right where he wants it, does not mean it's going to shoot the same place for you. Uh, that's the thing about it. And I think I'm going to go and get a hood, because the hood with the peep sight helps you align it. A lot of hunters don't like the hood, because it can snag on stuff, but... We'll try to get this tuned in. I'm not going to drill and tap it for a scope. I'll leave it as is. So let's see what we got going on here. Okay, that one went in a totally different place. better. I'm remembering the sight picture and getting it in. It all depends where you float it. Those two are right down center and low. You try to bring it up closer to the bullseye. The thing about this is you have to remember where the sight picture is. Like I said with the hood, the hood when you look through the peep sight will help you line it up. Uh, So it's a little bit more difficult than using a scope, but it's usable. Yeah, company. Well, I fired that last one off. Get a good group. So that takes care of the old ammo. Okay, our converted Mauser. Please disregard these here. This is from another gun. So my first shot was way up in the corner up there. So I changed the sight picture and started getting down into here basically down in here and in here and it's still not a bad group but it's the way you line them iron sights up so that's a four shot group all aiming in the same place after I had another sight picture and was way up there so 
that's not bad. I just have to adjust that sight and figure out how I want to aim and then adjust it. And it's still a pretty good group for an old military sporterized gun. So that's my first try with this.